So Raphael is going to have a Zoom meeting tomorrow. Abigail had her Zoom meeting with her teacher today. And I keep washing this shirt and reusing it over and over again because that's the most comfortable fitting shirt I was able to buy this year. I don't see myself going to Goodwill or other places just to find comfortable shirts or sports, you know, the dry fit and all that. Because I gain weight and I do plan on losing it. So I'm going to be using a lot of this shirt. You'll see that and a couple of more that you have seen that are just loosely fitting and nice to, to just be around in all day, basically. Abigail, my little friend here, my little googies, what have you been learning all today? All day? A, B, C. You want to sing it for us? Yes. Go ahead. A, B, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, N, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, and Z. Now my Googies knows my ABCs. So, we, we are going to start doing her kindergarten school work right after she's done uh, perfecting her ABCs, and that's very, very good. It was not like this this morning. Uh, she had some, uh, what do we have? We have I and R you were confused with. And he had A and G because all the letters are like upside down of each other. U and V and W and M and N. But now we're knowing, now we know how to do that. Yay! Right on. Very good. And we haven't been in the school environment for about four months, I'd say. That was very, very long. That was the longest summer break I've ever had, I think, for any of them. Because she wasn't at school yet, and Raphael simply finished all of his stuff almost two months earlier than the end of the school year. Uh, because he, he likes to work hard and play hard. Right? Play or plan? Play hard. <laughs> work hard, play hard. It's a saying. Daddy! Uh... I don't know what play hard means. Play a lot, have a lot of fun playing. Yeah. Yeah, he likes that. I What's did up? that on Minecraft after four or five assignments. I, when I got my pants on this morning, it showed size seven. Uh-huh. She knows how to count too. So Raphael is actually doing his mathematics and we're going to do five assignments, just that for today. They're supposed to do five assignments each per week for every subject, each subject. And we'll probably be doing, if you, the more extras you do, the longer of a break you'll have. Like, so that works. How many minutes per extra? Well, it depends on how fast you get stuff done. So right now he's doing his PDF work right there to solve some open number line questions. I'm not good with open number lines, and this first lesson is number line. Completely. Number Even better, line. it's a challenge. Treat yeah. it like a challenge. Is it like extra time because it's a challenge? Nope. We're going to finish this assignment and then we'll take a break. I think we're going to eat. Lunch. What do you think? Okay. You know how you sometimes... That's their ABC song right there. You know how sometimes you feel like you're in a limbo? You got her over there doing her internet work. And we have these kids right here at home with me. And every day it's like this now. 
like how many was it three weeks ago I complained that we didn't have rain or something like that I, I don't really remember when because we had like a two week break from rain and now look at it it's just we're on a flood watch we've been for a long time now it's completely white outside every day but dark it's just everything is just like a repetitive composition of a day can't really do much I didn't know it was raining on my ABC stuff yeah and right now it's about 1 p.m. and look look Abigail look at that see how much light we have Yay. that's how it actually looks right now <laughs> right yeah without yeah. these screens it'll be amazingly look, dark look over there look how white it is it's crazy oh, I, it's actually God. crazy <laughs> it's just white with rain it's white with rain and fog right that is crazy yeah well I'll leave you to it so you can go ahead and get done. We, I, I like what Andrea did with the little uh, station right there for Abigail to do her artwork and stuff. It's it because we can't do it on the desk. This is very good for learning, by the way. So far, I like it. Maybe a little too close between the two of them, but it's good. They mind their own business. All right, Lugie. Yeah. Looks like you want to exercise. Bye, guys. See you later, alligator. All right, so we have some cheese and mac, and I say cheese first because it's got more cheese than mac, I think. What? I made the cheese myself, the sauce. Thanks, Dad. Let me know what you think. It's pronounced macaroni and cheese. What do you think of it? It's great. Great? Yeah. All right. Well, hopefully that fills your little bellies up, and mm -hmm. we might have some meat later on. Mm hmm Uh-huh. Hey, guys. I'm in the most important room in the house, <laughs> the bathroom, uh, just to get away and say, hey, um, I'm having a little bit of a hard time with all of the new stuff that's going on. I hate like pressure. Uh, there's a lot of pressure on me right now. Um, you may have noticed that I take several breaks per week now. And I hadn't missed a day in like six years. Like I was working in the hospital when I had both of my babies. I was working in the hospital. So now I am actually taking breaks. And it's been pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Um, I, I don't feel good about it because, you know, I want to not disappoint anyone but at the same time I need a break because I'm feeling lots and lots of pressure uh, there's a lot of stuff going on for work uh, there's a lot of stuff going on for YouTube and there's a lot of stuff going on for the kids so there, it's just a lot of stuff going on right now so Hadar has taken over doing all of the um, kids work. The kids will now not just be going to school at home, but they're also going to school like real school several days a week. So it's like a half and half school and they're going to be doing art projects. There's enrichment projects. Okay, so there's art projects, uh, there's PE projects, and there are like special field trips and this happens every week and they have different things every week for the kids to do which I am really excited about and I didn't know where their base was but it's actually not too far away from here so that's good I don't actually know if you can hear that but my toilet runs constantly and I can't shut it off like you have to jiggle the handle for it to stop the loud noise, but that silent noise that's like just little trickling water in the back, it never stops. We have changed the pad that goes in it. We can't figure out what is wrong with it, but it will never stop. Yeah, it's probably not good. I need to fold some clothes today. Oh, and Abigail's birthday is this weekend. And it's just going to be something little. Um, my mom is the only person that's coming. We are going to go see Zeb in town. 
he actually has a new job where he's working many, many, many hours, but he has more responsibility and he likes it a lot better. So that's good. You want to have a, a job where you feel important and people like you and you like the people that you work with. Don't ever stay in a job that you don't like, right? Who did that? Who stopped it early? What? So yeah, just feeling a little bit of pressure from some of the stuff that I have to do. But, you know, having a couple of days off a week, that's really, really helped my mental health. I <laughs> I look tired because I am. I just woke up from a nap just a little while ago. I did a lot of work today. A lot. Um, and it was a lot of mental capacity that I used up today. And it exhausted me. Exhausted. Um, there's a lot of things that I can't keep up with. I just can't. Uh, it's more work than anybody, any any normal person can do. I've tried. It's just impossible. Um, and I've taken the stress off of myself by getting rid of that guilt. There's still a little guilt there for not getting it all done. And I think that's just... Humans, humans feel guilt when they're not able to do more than their capacity. Um, and when you, when you have an abnormal fatigue about you, um, you get even more guilt. So I'm, I'm trying to let that go and do as much as I can. As much as I can. It might not be as much as... It isn't as much as some people, but it might be more than others. I don't know. Probably not. But I'm trying, and that's all that I can do. Um, so I've been talking to my mom and talking to Zeb, and yeah, Zeb's not, he's not going to be able to make it. It's either very late or very early that he can come over, and I was like, no, because it's far, so um, don't do that, so... Uh, we will go up there and see him. The kids are really excited to see him. And we will probably go swimming with him. So that'll be fun for the kids. So he already invited us over. But we had to cancel because the kids had their first day of school today. So yeah, that was really exciting. Um, Raphael has an appointment tomorrow. But he also has a Zoom meeting, and I don't know how that's going to work because his Zoom meetings fall on the same day that he has therapy. So that's going to be very unfortunate because he's not going to talk to like half of his class at that time. He will get to meet them this year, like in person. And it's nice because their class is small, so they don't have a whole bunch of people there. And he's able to like pretty much have friends that are not involved with a bunch of people so it's like more like a six or eight person class than it is like a 25 person class so you're able to interact better with people when it's a really really small class like that are you okay she loves laundry day kitty yeah, I'm surprised she's not in my laundry right now. Anyway, so I just want to say sorry, but I can't be sorry. <laughs> sorry for not having a vlog every single day. I know how frustrating that is. Trust me, I know. Um, it's frustrating for me as well. It's also frustrating for me when I watch somebody on YouTube and they're like, where's your videos? What are you doing? <laughs> you know what I mean? It's hard to comprehend that they do have a life outside of the life that they show. But we do, and right now, um, I'm like literally always struggling. And I don't want to struggle anymore. I want things to be easy. Can things be easy? I don't think so. Um, once this week gets over, I really want to get back to a daily schedule and having two days off per week. That has been super nice. The unfortunate thing is... I take random days off during the week, and you never know when a video is going to be up. And I don't like being that 
not scheduled. So let me figure this out and I will get back to you when I get my stuff together. And thank you guys for watching. And Kitty's trying to jump out of the basket but can't. You okay? Okay. We will see you guys tomorrow. Have a good night. Bye. Kitty. You'll say bye. Kitty. Oh. Okay. And this is literally enormous now. It's the size of the jar and it started out that big. Enormous. Good morning! So this morning we're gonna have some show and tell before we get some haircuts. <laughs> Pokemon. Uh -huh. Looking good. I love it. So you can look in the back of your face. <laughs>